Bro, I just saw Aquaman. And God damn it, this shit is so fucking good! Oh, fuck! DC got it right! DC figured this shit out, bro! Oh, shit! <laughs> Calm down from the hype of the movie. Had a few drinks. Adrenaline's kind of gone. Aquaman was amazing. And like the, I'm still my legs still shaking. I drove at your fast home. From the movie theater. I don't know why. My adrenaline is just going. I don't know what DC did recently. I don't know how they got it done. I don't know who they hired. They must have hired somebody from uh, Marvel. Because Aquaman being what it is. Aquaman. The hero he is. Regular DC. They put a Marvel... They marveled his ass up. Oh my god. Bro. Ugh. Bravo. Bravo, DC. Jesus. Jesus. Whew. Bravo. You, you did good. You did good. <laughs> like... They figured it out, finally. Took them a few movies. Justice League was kind of getting there. Aquaman is the best DC movie made so far. So I am really happy to see what they do next. Like, I, I'm, I'm hyped to see what's next. Now I'm really hyped for Flash. I was hyped before because of um, CW's Flash. And how they they can make that so much better with the movie budget. But man, yeah, like I'm hype. I'm really hyped for Flash. I don't know what they got going on with Flash right now. Cause after last time I heard, um, they was having issues with filming. But I'm hyped for it. DC got my attention. DC got my attention. This the Aquaman movie. Wonder Woman was dope too. But I think this top Wonder Woman by a lot. This is almost. I wouldn't say almost. This this top. This not. I don't say tops. But it's pretty close to Infinity Wars. Pretty close. Pretty close feeling. Not the same like with the ending and all, but pretty close feeling. Like like a lit movie, very lit. I had to really calm down before I'm filming this because as you can see. Whew, oh god, yeah. Aquaman was dope. Dope movie. Very dope movie. Took me three drinks to calm down. This bruh. Mm, mm, mm. And Aquaman with the trident and the armor, bruh. When he got that armor, bruh, when he got the armor, oh, bro, shit went down. Like, shit was going down before, but it wasn't going down when he got, until after he got that armor. When he got the armor, it was a wrap. It was a wrap. We got to try that. But like the plot from the plot to the villain. Like I always like the villain. Black Mantis. Oh. Dope ass villain. 
He's always been dope. Um, yeah, I liked him from freaking um, Young Justice. So that's the cart the cartoon. So they, as soon as I saw he was in the movie, I was like, oh, okay, this might be dope because Black Mantis is just that nigga. And how he became. I'm trying not to spoil it for anybody, but man. It's kind of hard to, to right now because there's it's so much stuff I want to say. And I know it's going to spoil for somebody to see it. Good ass movie. DC, DC gets DC, DC trying to get that respect because, yeah, they own Marvel ass now. They, they come with the, they come with the heat. Infinity War, who? I'm still kind of mad at Infinity War for that ending, but yeah. Infinity War, who? They, DC's like, we got a word, bet, Captain Marvel, bet. Got something for you. Just the way they just did Aquaman. They, they gave, like, in the cartoons, Aquaman's a little bitch. If we being honest. So, so the motherfucker just talks to fish. They made this motherfucker bad ass. Mira, bad ass. Hand credits, shh. Forget about it. Forget about it. The Seamaster. He's dope. We all know that. Like, I eventually went into it thinking that the Seamaster was going to be like a little side villain, but that was not the case. Black Masters is that dude. He it wasn't really a main uh, no, yeah, it was kind of a main villain. But how they pieced it together from the beginning to the end. It it had a it had an Iron Man feel to it. In the DC universe. That's with the plot. You know how Iron Man kind of created his own villains. That's kind of how Aqu- that's how they went about with Aquaman. That's how I feel, you know. Whew. But all in all, out of ten, I give it a nine point five. I'm not gonna lie to you. And I'm not really, I've never really been a DC character other than, Bat- like, a DC fan. I've never been a DC fan other than Batman. Batman's the only big villain. Darkness Rises is classic. But, like, other than that, like, I've never really been a DC, like, Superman was lame to me. And, like, Green Lantern was stupid. So, like, I... I've never really been a DC fan. I've always been Marvel mostly. The only hero I liked from DC was Batman. That was it. Like, I didn't fuck with in Flash because of CW. But that was that was basically it. I didn't really fuck with no other heroes, no villains. But Aquaman. Woo! Aquaman. Aquaman's a keeper. They, they picked the right one. Badass in the morning. They, they, picked, they picked the right cast for this movie. And it shows. It shows. God damn. But yeah, that's, that's, that's really all I can say without spoiling it. Because... I'm a, I guess I'm gonna give it like a week or so. Like spoiler review, maybe, as I just goes. But thanks for watching. Like you saw, give a thumbs up. Not, kiss my ass. Not really, but yeah. This is. Tripping, really got the TikTok mission.